you are welcome once more to my channel. Well, this is Desert Oasis. My name is Martins Akimbode. Uh, we thank God for another opportunity to fellowship to discuss today. Uh, well, today I want to discuss with us the topic of courtesy. So, uh, you know, this topic, I think it is very important that we discuss about it because uh, this topic is really uh, crucial for anyone who is going to have a part in the things of God in this present uh, days. Okay, uh, you know, courtesy is uh, is one topic that uh, many of us in this generation we we have really uh, neglected. We don't. We are not. Many of us we are not uh, taught about this. It may be from our uh, our background. Our the way we are being brought up, the family that we are being brought up in, okay, due to our culture, our, 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 you know, we have been trained in the culture of the world, of the culture of, uh, of, 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 of player, of uh, self love, self care, you know, selfishness. Uh, stinginess, uh, you know, all those kind of things. I don't think there is anyone who, who only cares about himself alone, who is a selfish person, a very stingy person, who we ever have a place of mercy with God. It is not possible. Okay? You can't have that kind of trait and you will be a partaker in the divine or you will have you will even have a relationship with God it is not possible okay so it is it is it is it is demonic injection demonic training it is not a way of life it is not a way of life it is not a way of life it is not acceptable before God it is devil that is behind all of these traits okay and it is it is it is a trait that you know that used to make it, it used to uh, limit the extent to which a man could go in in life and with God okay it used to limit it is it is it is it is brings limitation those kind of traits stinginess uh, only me and myself <laughs> it's, it's, it's a bad trait if any or any of us have this kind of traits ah, we need to get rid of those kind of training from inside of us because there is no way a man can get anywhere with God there is no way okay in in act act 10 uh, act 10 1 to 4 I will be quoting some uh, Bible verse to buttress this point. So Act 10, 1 to 4. That place was talking about a certain uh, man, a Caesarea, who is Cornelius. Okay? A Cornelius. The Bible say, before God sent an angel to this man for the door of mercy to be open for him at all, you know, Bible make talk about this uh, man treat. The character that he possess okay Bible was talking that's one of his character is he give him to strangers all around him okay to strangers all around him okay in Hebrew Hebrew 13 2 he was talking about encouraging people about this good trait that they should entertain stranger and brethren okay that's in so doing, many people have entertained angels in 
passage without knowing and you know that open a door of mercy for them in genesis genesis 19 genesis 19 sodom uh is talking about this story of the people in the days of uh abraham sodom this is sodom when god sent uh, his angel to sodom for the destruction of its very terrible uh, city that is given to, to to lesbianism to gay to to all kind of evil okay so there is lot in genesis 19 lot he, he saw this angel that god has sent to destroy this city he saw them so he gets he approached them uh, engaged them and he insisted that no he must get this man into his house today and take care of them take care of their need for that night that they cannot stay in the city's uh, square and these are ages that god has sent to destroy sodom and gomorrah can you imagine but what saves Lot is because of his uh, hospitality because he is a, is a man who has courtesy okay is what that is what saving he, he would have got destroyed with all of these people as well and these people the, the, the craziness that is upon them moved them so much that they drew near to angels that ah they want to have sex with angels because can you imagine they so much lack they are so much full of pollution and uh, 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 you know corrupt minds no regards they have no regards for for nobody okay they want to have sex with this stranger they have no regards that, do, do, that is turning over such attitude they've cultivated over time. Okay, they have no regards at all. They want to have sex with them and, you know, that act moves God more. It makes their <laughs> cup of rot before God to be full. That God had to rain down at, uh, 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 brimstone and, you know, fire on those city to destroy them that they couldn't even find the arches okay in genesis genesis 18 talking of abraham and sarah you know this same angel they came and abraham saw them for from afar and he went close to them you know he told them ah he must prepare a special dish for them he must kill his calf give them meat give them bread he took them into uh, his house you know, he make a feast for them, okay, and that sprung uh, them that Abraham, you are going to have a child. He is a barren man, and you know, you are telling about all the promises of God. You know, the same major that came to destroy a city, they are the one rescuing people. They are the same one giving another person a promise. That no, it's going to have a child. It can it cannot be buried. The same major that came for destruction. Okay? So uh, in Hebrews 11, 31, it's talking of Rehab the Harlot, who received the spies that was sent to spy uh, that city. That you know, talking about this Rehab the Harlot, you know, he, 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 he she also she's an harlot. But because of our courtesy, that saves her from perishing with those who are perishing in these days. In Luke, Luke 7, 44 to 48, talking of one woman as well, who is an alert as well. You know, she, she has spent all her years on vanity. Okay? On vanity. She's empty. But this woman has an attitude. She has caught sea. Okay? So, in this place, the Lord Jesus Christ, this woman came, brought oil, was weeping on the feet of the Lord Jesus Christ. She was cleaning his feet, a dusty feet, okay? Kissing him, uh, wiping his, his, his feet with her ear. Precious, costly ear. Okay? And 
the Lord Jesus Christ was saying that to his disciple that this woman he was saying to, to Peter that since I ever enter your house, you have not even given me a water. You have not given me nothing. And this woman has she has shown more, much love. And the Lord Jesus Christ, this woman received a sin, a polluted life, a broken life. You know, a broken life became she became an only person. A transformed person due to her courtesy okay her life was transformed her many sins okay her many sins she became Bible did not talk in details but she you know her many sins that covers you know cleans all our whole messes away all our whole messes okay she became an honorable person in life and in eternity. Okay? All her mess is because she has courtesy. Okay? She has courtesy. Okay? Uh, let's go to... To... Uh, Third John, Third John 1, 5 to 6. He was talking of uh, a man called Gaius. And this man, John was writing and he was saying, Ah, oh beloved, you do well in everything that you do for the brethren and for strangers. Okay? Talking about his charity. In Matthew, Matthew 25, 31 to 46, he said, The Lord Jesus Christ said, when the, when, when the Son of Man shall come in his glory, he will call some people. Uh, and he will begin to say to them that when I was naked, you clothed me. I was sick, you, f you visited me. I was, uh, I was hungry, you fed me. And he will say to them that they should enter into glory. Okay? And he will call some other set of people. And you say, I was sick. You, you didn't uh, visit me. Hungry, thirsty, you didn't uh, feed me. I was naked. You didn't clothe me. He said, Go to let's prepare for you. Why? And they said, When do we see you sick and all of this and that we didn't clothe you? He said to them that in as much as you have not done it to one of these my brethren here, you have also not uh, done it to for me. Okay? So it is important. This thing is no joke. It is no joke. It, we can't afford. It, no courtesy. It's all. It, 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 it wasn't only about just even giving. Okay. Although I will come to talk about giving later, but it is not just even only about giving. You know. Uh, when I read of the Lord Jesus Christ, when he he rose up from the dead. Okay. And you know, you just see him walking uh, on the streets, and his disciples they, they did not even know him, they can't recognize him anymore. Okay, that if not, uh, he would they, they, that place, uh, uh, I think in Luke now, was saying that when they were going on their way to. Uh, to on, on that in my house rose and you know they are they are their eyes were street restricted for me to, 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 to recognizing him to knowing him and when even negate them in, in, in talk that ah they say they have crucified uh, this old so man Jesus and that's why they are depressed sad and all of these things you know and after he he, 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 he started with them open their mind to the scripture that their hearts begin to burn Bible say he wants to be going on his way. Okay? He wanted to be going just on his own. Okay? Because the divine, unless we trap the divine, okay, we will be missing on many chances and many divine opportunities. Unless we trap it, trap the divine, okay, we will be missing a lot. 
will be missing a lot, a lot, a lot of of of, of chances, opportunities that could have that could have rescued us from famine in the days of Elijah. Can you imagine? A woman was rescued from famine because she has caught even in the midst of her last me. That this one, she's just looking for it to to <laughs> this one. If she she she, 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 she just uh, she's just going to eat it with her son, with her son and then, then but in the midst of that she she's a person with a merciful heart that oh she has cursing towards the man of God okay she has cursing and that rescued that in the midst of that family if she has she has decided that she, she's she's a stingy person who lack cost cost and she decided to go and eat that with 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 her. she would have died she would have died okay so uh the lord jesus christ when we look at a place when he was walking on the water okay when he was walking on the water the bible says that you in that scene that he was going to bypass them and go Okay, even though they are in the midst of of storm, can you imagine? They are in the midst of storm. They will have missed their miracle. In that particular instance, they would have missed their miracle. Okay, they would have missed their miracle. Court see, you know, uh, Lord Jesus Christ was saying that about was talking about the story of that man who. Uh, have workers in his, in his vineyard that are working for him, and this the man sends is 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 uh, the the owner of the farm sends uh, his servant to, to go and get the produce of his farm, and they treated that one anyhow. He now sent his son, and they they they, they make an agreement within themselves that oh well, this is owner uh, son we are going to kill this man, and we are going to gets the farm for ourselves in as much as we kill him and why because they they are people who lack courtesy okay with the lack courtesy okay courtesy can be in the place of 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 regard for truth okay can be in the place of regard for truth standing for truth okay Standing for truth, the man on the cross with the Lord Jesus Christ, that thief, you know, that man has caught him. Okay, in the midst of hypocrisy, lies, uh, mockery, and everything going on, this man, you know, rebuke his, his fellow and he was saying the truth and you know, standing for what is right. Okay. That man, he has, he has regards and courtesy. Okay, he has some regards. Okay, so we can't ever afford not to have courtesy. We can't go nowhere with God. We 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 can't go nowhere with God without courtesy. With without, but the other place in Bible say, he does give. Give on a little of this one, a cup of water, and you shall, you know, wise lose his reward. We have to uh, imbibe such traits. Okay, there's no way a man is going without courtesy. You are not going nowhere in life. You are not going nowhere in heaven. Okay, it is very important. It is very important. Uh, this is the place where I will be dropping the quoting for today. Thank you for listening and God bless you.